Hey everyone, it's Jill and Tina again, and we are super excited to be here with you because we have a lot of stuff to talk about, about Mother's Day and Schools of Hope and all that kind of stuff. So Jill, start us off and tell us a little bit about what's going on with Women United. Hey Tina, thanks so much. Absolutely. As you know, Mother's Day is coming up here. And so we at Women United, you know, I, we've got gotcha. you. We have a great opportunity for you to honor your mother or the mother figure in your life while helping out the kids in Dane County by supporting the Schools of Hope Literacy Tutoring Program. You know, because let, let's be frank here. Most years I'm scrambling to find something for my mom. And while flowers are nice, you know, year after year, it can be a little bit of a wah-wah. So that's why I'm really excited about this opportunity that we're here to tell you about today. In celebration of Mother's Day this year, you can all join Women United in honoring all the mothers or the mother figures who, you know, most of them were our first teachers and be able to really do something that advances our community and honors them at the same time. You know, I thought it was crazy when I learned that, you know, kids, they learn to read up until about the third grade. And then after that, they're reading to learn. So if you have kids who didn't get a good start, you know, at reading right from the beginning, well, they are always playing catch up. So Tina, what can you tell us about the Schools of Hope and how people can help this year? Yeah, so this is really exciting. We have great opportunities here. So the Schools of Hope is a literacy program uh, that provides one-on-one -on -one reading support to elementary school students in our community here in Dane County. And so it's an amazing program. Um, that we know that reading is critical to the success of someone um, and you know perhaps it's your mother or your father or someone like that um, in your life who really means a lot and so here's here's the deal our goal is to raise ten thousand dollars for the schools of hope and you have two different ways that you can get involved obviously donations right and we're going to put the link right down below for you to um, to donate but just like when we run a race or something like that you can have your own personal page and um, create a whole fundraising effort around that um, on your own so it's a couple of different ways to get involved a couple of different ways to support schools of hope and we're really excited to get going with it absolutely you know tina uh, in the last couple of years my kids know how important women united and schools of hope are to me so in the past they've made contributions in my name and you know it's easy peasy you know it's a quick visit to the website and it's done there's no shopping no wrapping no returning you know it's just right there easy for people and you get a chance to, to really make an impact in the community so tina you said that uh you know there were a couple of different ways to do this do we have a goal we do our goal is ten thousand dollars and we are going to get to that goal super excited about that so if you are interested if you are excited about this program uh, DM us, drop your name below. We're going to put all the information and the links in this in this um, post and all that good stuff. And we would really, really invite you to come be a part of this because it's going to be something pretty amazing. Absolutely. You know, this is a chance to honor your mom or, or maybe a teacher who had a big impact on you, you know, and make a difference in the lives of the children of Dane County. So whether you want to, you know, give or maybe, you know, really uh, make an impact and set up a fundraiser of your own, we've got the instructions for you. We can make it easy. So please join us this year. Honor your mother, honor a mother figure and help the kids of Dane County. Awesome. Thank you, Jill. We'll see you later. Bye now. Bye.